we had a we got a call in March or February of last year from uh, uh, Dr. Sten Vermont, who's the head of the Yale School of Public Health, and who said, "Y'all are the best messengers, Creative Coalition. We need messaging for these vaccines. Would you work with us?" And I'm like. Uh, yeah, I think we will. <laughs> that took about 10 seconds to decide. It was such an honor to be called upon by you know, the medical community to do this. And we're very, we, we, we make sure that we learn, that we educate ourselves first before we try to message something. And so we sat in a lot of um, lectures and seminars and in a very quick time to understand what the issue was going to be and was going to be with what was going to be what was with vaccines. And we, again, being the creative coalition, we're great at collating people. We're great at bringing in people who are experts when we're not. We're experts with words. We're experts with messaging. So we knew that at that time, there were seven communities of uh, hesitation at the beginning of the COVID vaccine. Um, and we brought in behavioral scientists. We brought in the best writers, producers, directors to help us make this message. We brought on people like you, Julie, from the medical community who could give us guidance because we know how to be persuasive with words and with artistic assets, but we needed the behavioral scientists. We needed the medical community to tell us if we were on target. And we also then worked with community leaders in these seven areas of hesitation. And then when we, we produced these PSAs, we made sure that we were speaking to these seven communities of hesitation with substance, with messaging that made sense, because it was a different message for rural America than it was for the Latinx community. And so we are continuing now, we're about to launch a campaign about boosters and about home testing. Um, so we, it's our duty as artists, as citizens of this world and as artists to use our, va what is our value added? Our value added is distilling messaging to make an impact. And that's our civic duty.